You know those recipes that are almost embarrassingly easy to make? This is one of those recipes and I have no shame whatsoever. We start off with some milk chocolate and dark chocolate in a pan. Essentially you need 300 grams of chocolate. With that I've got 100 grams of unsalted butter. I'm going to add four tablespoons, that's a good glug, of golden syrup. Then this is going to go on a very low heat, which you need to watch like a hawk, don't let it burn. Once you only have a few lumps of chocolate remaining, that's the time to turn off the heat. And that's all the hard work that is involved in making this rocky road. I did tell you it was embarrassing, didn't I? For my biscuits, I like these little round ones because they look really nice when you cut them. And you'll need 200 grams. I'm also going to add in our lovely California raisins. Now these are technically one of your five a day, so this is a health food. Well, it is now. Pistachio nuts go in, that's 150 grams of pistachio nuts. And then for a little extra added color, our marshmallows. So these are gonna go in. Oh, this is so lovely. Your last job is to give everything a stir. Make sure all of the bits that you've added get covered in chocolate. A silicon cake tin is going to be your friend here because you'll find it much easier to pop the chocolate out once it's set. Give everything a good press down. I do have a mild addiction to sprinkles. Gold stars, some little holly berries and holly leaves. Gold salt is just a little taste of heaven. Your next job, if you can call it a job, is to leave this out at room temperature. Leave it a few hours until it's completely set, carve it up into great big pieces and enjoy. Enjoy.